What's good? What's good? Welcome back to Invest and Trade with Jack's gonna go with our friend Phantom. Currently we're sitting at 281. We're down about 9% on the day. We're sitting at a market cap of 7.63 billion. 24 hour volume, 1.68 billion. Ladies and gentlemen, if you're new to crypto.com, sign up to the world's fastest growing crypto app. And you can grab one of the incredible Visa cards for cash back in crypto, free Spotify, Netflix, Prime, Travel Incentives. $25 just for signing up through my referral. So let's hop into Phantom. We're here on the one hour time frame. Quickly turn up my screen brightness. So our first entry was 284. We had just locked in a juicy trade. We had entered in this area. Extremely juicy trade of 17, 18%. So I closed about 75% of my trade. I broke even on the rest of my trade at 284 and I re-entered. And then my leverage trade, which I'll throw up on the screen, I just added a little bit of money to it. So we have broken below that level of support. However, guys, you can see on the RSI, as well as the money flow, we're completely in the floor. And that is usually when you see a bounce back to the upside. Of course, you can just get rejected. You can come up, you can get rejected by the EMAs. But the bullish strength is very, very strong for Phantom. And when Bitcoin sees a little bit of green, Phantom tends to explode. So there is a pattern to watch here. If we bounce up and we break the EMAs and we come up and we start to hit resistance, 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 well, what we're doing is we're creating a head and shoulders. So you have your left shoulder, you have your head, and then you have your right shoulder. Just a second, guys. I just got a little bit of like carpal tunnel in my wrist. Um, I don't think it's healthy to <laughs> have your wrist kind of going like this for most of the day. <clears throat> but I'll be okay, guys. No need to worry. <laughs> so let's hop over to the four hour time frame. Now, of course, a head and shoulders is a bearish pattern. So if we come up, we hit resistance, we roll over, we break the neckline. It is quite a ways away from happening. But I'll drop in your technical target to the downside. Could bring Phantom down just below our next buy zone at 243 for FTM. But you can see as well on the RSI and, and the money flow on the four hour, we are turning back towards oversold. And that is usually when you're gonna see a bounce. As you can see here, bounce back to the upside. Let me give one more example. Down here, you can see the RSI, the low section, as well as the money flow. Bounce back to the upside right here as well. Bounce back to the upside. So a nice bounce should come relatively soon. Of course, you can also do consolidation where you just consolidate and then you drop lower. So that's something to keep in mind as well. But as I've been mentioning, the bullish strength is just so strong for FTM. I do think we could see a nice bounce back up to that resistance at 313, which would be a juicy trade opportunity of about 10% for our friend FTM. So as many investors have just been holding, 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 waiting to get back up to these highs, We've made many, many trades. We made a 70% trade right here. We made a 50% trade right here. We traded this breakout as well. So we've made, I think, like five or six trades in this pump. And, and this pump so far has lasted about 27 days. So in about a month's time, we've made, I'm not sure how many trades, but quite a few, maybe five or six trades. So we've been doing very, very well with our friend FTM. We are underneath the EMAs on the four hour time frame. So do watch that, guys. We've broken underneath the 50 so we can start hitting them as resistance but as you can see here we broke below we created a double bottom and we broke out back to the upside it's more important in my opinion to watch the emas on the daily time frame we've come back down to the 20 i did talk about us coming back down to the 55 once again which is right now coming in about 236 we do have to watch this double top pattern guys if we roll and we come down here and we break this neckline i will give a breakdown target for this double top Go from the neckline up to your top of your pattern, drag it down, and could bring our friend Phantom down to about 143. So just something to keep an eye on. However, we have had the bullish cross on the daily, which is a massive sign of a pump. And as of right now, Bitcoin is simply coming back down for a retest, in my opinion, just as we did here, before seeing a nice bounce back up to the EMAs. It's not until we lose this low at 40K that we have to target lower price target for Bitcoin and for the rest of the market. But as you can see, the RSI in the floor, money flow in the floor on the four hour that's usually when you're going to see a nice bounce we pop over to this chart here for phantom you can see we came very very close to our resistance at 358 our money flow is trending towards the bottom section once again on the daily 
So I do think we could see a nice bounce as long as we hold the EMAs. We can definitely see continuation for FTM, but we do have that bearish divergence that we have to watch very, very closely, as well as the bearish indicator on the MACD. If we have the bearish cross, you can see the blue line is about to curl underneath. That is an early indicator of a move back down. We have just had a juicy pump for FTM. So we could come down for a retest of 209, but honestly, the bullish strength is so strong for FTM. I think if Bitcoin just can continues to consolidate in our Wyckoff we see a nice bounce where we have a good chance of seeing phantom continuing to pump to the upside so our buy zones we hit our first one 284 we have our next ones here 243 218 191 136 115 equal amounts at each buy zone brings it down halfway each time as a spot trader if you're leverage trading you have to double your margin I'll give you our price targets for our bull run for FTM let me quickly pop open the chart uh, where am I? Where am I? FTM. Oh, here we go, guys. So we have the two extension coming in at 604, but my bull run target is here, the 2.272 at 1008. If you want early access to these charts as well as 1,000 members talking all things crypto, posting chart patterns, and the DCA charts are updated regularly as well as the DCA trade strategy is fully explained, it's 350 USD, guys, $3.50. You really can't beat it. And it can definitely be one of the greatest investments that you'll ever make for the price. All right, guys, if you want to trade with me, sign up to Bybit. $4,100 in bonuses for a limited time. Follow me on IG if you want to stay up to date with my personal life. And I will see you in the next video. All right. Much love. Take care.